G'day, this is AusAD V-Rider. Today I'm at Mount Robertson testing out my new front end. That is a 2009 Yamaha WR450 front end on a 2008 Suzuki V-Strom 650. Now it's way wetter than I thought up here. Just coming down this track was greasy as slight, um, slight downhill. I was sliding the whole way. It's lucky I didn't lose it. Um, I was planning on taking this track. But, um, it's a good fun track down there. But it's usually pretty wet, so I'm guessing it's going to be very slippery today. So we'll head up this way. That splits into two. And we'll try those out. And the bike handled the twisties really well going up to King Lake. The roads were a bit greasy, so I couldn't push it too hard. But man, that felt nice. Yeah, this isn't too bad here, actually. Got that first bit was slippery. Oh no, Glenburn Spur. <laughs> Glenburn Spur. Should we try that? I know it's going to be greasy the first bit. It goes down a steep hill, which is usually good. Tell you what, we'll go straight, and then we'll come back around. If that one's greasy going downhill, I'm in big trouble, because it's a steep hill. Yeah, I was really hoping to do some faster stuff and see how that front end handles it. Not when it's this greasy, though. We might just have to do um, Boggy Creek Road. It's fairly rocky, so it won't be slippery. It's still pretty rough, so yeah, we'll go. We'll go down and do that. Right, a Boggy Creek Road. So this should have plenty of grip. It's pretty rocky, this road. Fairly bumpy, so should give me a bit better idea on this front end. So there's Glenburn there. Should we go up and have a look? I think we should. What oh, this is a big hill. It's actually quite nice. Um, it's dry gravel, so it's all good. I'm in second gear. I was asked about the gearing on my bike. I've only gone up one tooth on the rear. Gives it a bit better acceleration. I'd probably like to go another one. Now the reason I didn't go smaller on the front is because with my bike raised so high the uh, chain will actually rub on the front of the swing arm. If I was to have a smaller sprocket I'd have troubles. Yeah I think standard's 1547 gearing, I've got 1548. There we are back where I started. Is it? I think so. <laughs> no, I was at the other one, wasn't I? Anyway, we're going back down. Definitely smoother, I can go a lot faster. Yeah, it's a rough road, I can let my hands go. Can't complain about that. I was a bit worried about the stability. These forks have got a much shorter offset between the forks and the um, steering stem than the V-Stroms. I thought it might become a bit unstable. Let's try this one. This is the one I was at the top of and wasn't sure about doing. We shall try. Ooh.
Now, I'm sure that front end's bottoming out, but it's not harsh. Look, I'm thud. So far, this track's good fun. Nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that is a fun track. Go for a quick dip. <laughs> Whoa. Oh man. Right, oh, no. we're going back down there. That was fun. We're good. Right, I'll oh, see what this one's like uphill. Could be interesting. Then we'll get out of here, I reckon. Check the landing before you go launching it off those. Slippery, 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 slippery. <laughs> right, I'm really happy with how the bike's gone today. I'm going to attempt to get back out of here. This was slippery as on the way in. Oh, mate. <laughs> made it. Well, right, thanks a lot for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the... Oh, shit! <laughs> hope you've enjoyed the video. I'll see you next time. <laughs> oh, mate. <laughs> well, I've got to stop and clean my undies out. See you next time. <laughs>